security and risk management styles, influences, and habits. Where did you learn management? By learn, I mean specific studies, education, research, application, and refinement of a management system inclusive of people. By management, I mean a learning adaptive process to enable and enhance commercial results. If you are exposed, responsible, or promoted within government services, such as the police, military, intelligence, or other public service roles, it's not the same as management and leadership in the commercial and corporate world. Government and public service management are unique and specific to the role and services it provides, which is not that of corporate or commercial security. This includes the management and delivery of commercial security services. Have you studied leadership? Do you know the specific qualitative and quantitative differences between leadership and management? Have you heard about the managerial grid developed in 1964? Blake and Newton, 1985. Alternatively, is your leadership concept more akin to a title, role, or seniority? What do you think of Peter Drucker's work? Where does your experience come from? I mean specific to a corporate or commercial environment. If you have a public service pedigree, which is dominant or more extended in years? Alternatively, is your management and leadership more of a mashup of the Mongol discipline of management? Hearst 2013. Did you know 9 out of 10 private sector's employees would be unlikely to take employees offloaded from the public sector? Mullins 2016. Is your management style, influence or habits consistent and specific to your organisation and the prevailing culture? Do you know the difference? Do you understand, motivate and retain millennials? Ashgar 2014. Have you learned any lessons from Google's experiments and evaluations as a result of Project Oxygen? Gavin 2013. Do you agree that business schools are not professional schools or are a one-stop shop certification shop? Barker, 2010. Do you understand the rewards and damages that came from the Hawthorne studies? Ketchell, 2012. Where do you sit with regards to the view that corporate security professionals are a hybrid agent between corporate and national security? Peterson, 2013. Did you know that security management, even today, has been a subject of very little research or comments by management specialists? Banfield, 2014. Considering all this, is your security and risk technical qualifications and skills commensurate with the required level of management? Alternatively, are they something you learned a long time ago in a different role and environment? Security risk management is a learned and scientific process. It's not just something you pick up along the way. Far too many security practitioners and managers have learned the hard way that management is learned and taking one management concept or process from one business environment to another, like your laptop, doesn't work. Failures, discontent, conflict and significant waste of resources have resulted. Everyone in the security industry is then labelled and viewed the same, especially those with government, military, police and intelligence backgrounds. Evolve or die. It's that brutal. You either hold your place in today's corporate and commercial environment, or you don't. If you aren't relevant or adaptive today, tomorrow will see your demise. This remains my top piece of advice for those entering the security industry. It's a shame, so many already in the industry haven't listened or adapted to. The next generation may have an accessible path to success as they step over and overtake all those living in the good old days. I'm Tony Ridley, International Security and Risk Management Professional. Here are the references cited here. Thank you for watching.